So I got a short message for all you uh, black voters who have decided to tell other black people who do not believe in voting, who are intelligent enough to understand uh, what voting is uh, and what this system is, what we can can and cannot talk about. You motherfuckers want to sit around and you're on your high horse. You got your little stick on your motherfucking shirt and that stick it and emboldened you to tell other black people that they can't talk about racism or what y'all want to call complain about racism. I refuse to call uh, people telling the truth complaining people talking about history complaining these are people that are simply calling it like it is telling the story how it's being written you motherfuckers not gonna tell me what the fuck i can and cannot talk about no i didn't motherfucking vote but you cannot tell me what i can talk about because there's a good chance um that if you talk to the black people who actually knowledgeably decided not to vote uh they know more about politics than you do you fail to understand how politics works, which is what got you running your dumb ass down to the polls thinking you about to make a goddamn difference or put a dent in racism by appointing uh, black people or by appointing Democrats. Because truth be told, <clears throat> y'all not telling people that uh, to go vote so they can vote Republican. Y'all telling people to go vote to uh, guilt them into voting for Democrats. That's the reality of it. You motherfuckers not going to tell me what the fuck I can and cannot talk about. Understand that. Now, there may be some other black people that you can shame with this type of rhetoric, but I'm not one of those type black people. So you can keep that bullshit to your motherfucking self. Don't come to my pages. Don't come to my videos telling me that I can't talk about uh, uh, black men being lynched uh, around this country. Uh, all of them being ruled suicides. Um, cops getting off three case. Don't get this shit fucked up uh, every time they kill an unarmed black a uh, 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 man, woman, or child. I'm not going to let y'all shame me into telling me I can't tell the truth because I didn't go down there and stand in these dumbass lines and feel like I did something to put a dent in racism. What's going to put a dent in the racism is for us to wake the fuck up and unify with each other, not unify within a system that is meant to oppress you, that is not going to come out and deal with you specifically, who's going to continue to call you a fucking minority. Well, at least I have sense enough to call you by name, you black folk. Your favorite politician ain't got the heart to even do that. Your favorite politician ain't even got the heart to utter the words white supremacy. They don't even have the heart to do that. So understand that you're not going to shame me and many of us into listening to your fuckery about voting. As you can see the picture on the goddamn screen here, this meme I made earlier. Y'all motherfuckers are like a bunch of Stevens to me. Telling me that I can't talk about anything if I don't go vote. The white man and his mama been telling black people to not talk about racism for forever. Now, y'all black people done picked up that same rhetoric because black people don't want to go vote because they understand that voting is some bullshit because they understand that building an economic base amongst each other, unifying with each other is way more important than running down to a goddamn poll. Fuck you. Keep that opinion to yourself. You voted. Be proud of it. We voted in record number this year. People run down to the polls in record number this year. So come this time in 2020, let's say in a couple of years here, uh, come around this time again, we'll be doubling back. And what will happen again the next time an election uh, is up, we'll be telling black people yet again how much we don't vote. And that rhetoric always works with y'all. Y'all let people tell y'all anything. I read a post today about a black, um, I think it was the first black governor that was elected in the city of Detroit in 19, the early 1970s. I looked at that post and I said, well, According to black folk, Maxine Waters didn't get voted by by black people. All of the black politicians in black areas, how the fuck you think they got in there? By black people voting for them. So stop one black people that's listening to this rhetoric. Stop letting people tell you this shit. Because every black politician that's been elected is thanks to other black people. You know damn well white people ain't voted for no black people like that in droves. Didn't happen. It was black folk. So stop letting people even tell you that black people aren't voting on state and local elections. That's bullshit. The black people that are in, in the political uh, arena right now are in there because of other black people. The black people that will continue to be entering the political arena will be in there because of black people voting. So stop telling black people they're not voting. What's happening is it doesn't matter who's in that motherfucking system and y'all haven't learned that yet. So y'all will continue to vote and you'll fill it up with all the black people you want and they will still be controlled. They will still not have an agenda set out for how to 
even the playing field here in this country where black people are concerned. That's the reality. I don't give a fuck if you feel like you're better than everybody else because you voted. You're not. You just believe. Same way y'all believe in a lot of bullshit out here. You, this is just something else that you believe in. It's been proven to be false many times for many decades now. But y'all continue. Stop guilting people, though. Stop shaming people, though. Stop telling black people they can't talk about racism and the idea of white supremacy or the white man and his motherfucking mom and their practices and how they've acted throughout history. Stop telling black people that. Just say you voted. Quit acting like it's been proven to work. Because it hasn't been. Y'all still fishing for that reality or for that perceived truth that you have to be true. It hasn't been proven to work yet. And the one thing we haven't done is unify as a people. Support each other, love each other. That's the one thing we haven't done yet. Y'all want to do everything else but the hardest thing. It seems to be the hardest thing to y'all is to unify. And that's the one thing y'all don't even want to fucking do at all. That's all the fuck I got to say. Y'all follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Links in the description box. If you want to support this channel, links in the description box. Mad love, shout out to Rob. Y'all already know what it is. I'm out.